To many, dance is a release, a time to forget all worries and obligations to immerse your body in an unforeseen journey forged by the melody. National Dance Week is a celebration of these feelings and many more. Every year, from April 24th to May 3rd, a week filled with dancing, teaching, and various other activities is celebrated around the country. The Dance Minor Program at the University of Delaware decided to bring the festivities to Delaware students and their surrounding community. This is the first time that we've hosted a celebration of National Dance Week here at UD. Kimberly Schroeder is the Dance Minor Director at the University of Delaware and plan the entire week. We put a call out to dancers, choreographers, and instructors in the area and have received an enormous response of people who are interested in coming to volunteer their time to teach classes. This week-long celebration includes discussions, movies, raffles, performances, and various free dance classes, all dedicated to educating the community on the art of dance. And all are welcome. National Dance Week isn't only about dancing and having fun. It's also an opportunity to donate to the Dancers Responding to AIDS organization. Dancers Responding to AIDS provides financial support for people in the entertainment industry with AIDS and other illnesses, while also promoting good health and well-being. By pairing dance and donations, National Dance Week seems to have it all. I think it's a really great project to have here on campus, a really great celebration of all the different aspects of dance and with groups and clubs and the Dance Minor campus that not necessarily everyone knows about and all the money that's going to be generated this week through um, raffle tickets and selling t-shirts and things like that is really going to a great cause um, for dancers advocating for the treatment of AIDS. With the enthusiasm National Dance Week generates, the Dance Minor program plans on making it an annual event. Cameron Clark, reporting for 49 News.